So we have been talking a lot about abutment connections in the last 10 years, but joint uh, platform switch, conical connections, about abutment materials, of course, about abutment shape. So it was quite difficult to make a choice. I always imagined when you are on this street looking at the race of the implants. Imagine you are the pilot of one of these systems. Sometimes you crash and you hope that you will be the guy sitting in this implant flying high. Now, the question is today, what is really important? I mean, is there one superior system? A lot of concepts and controversies arose in the last 10 years. And as a clinician, I was not sure anymore what I should use. However, I think it's important to look critical at a lot of these concepts and try to understand what is behind it. Of course, history always tells you the truth. And after 10 years, some of these systems just disappeared from the stage and were smashed, crashed by the reality. So whenever you don't hear anything about the concept, two possibilities, either it's so successful that you don't have to talk about it, or it's such a failure that nobody talks about it anymore. It's not that easy to understand what really is working in the clinic reality.